What's up guys? This is me Abhishek. Today in this video I'll teach you how to use a font without installing them. Why are you gonna use font without installing? There is some problem with your computers. If your laptops or computer does have the administrator right. For example if your laptop from the schools from or if you are using the library or in the college laptops, you want access to the you wanna use the font custom font you like. Like for example graphic designing, photoshop, something, if I got some assignment and for the photoshop or other, other, other kind of graphic designer and you wanna make cool as you, as you can as possible and you wanna use the custom font but you can't with the administrator right. I'll show you how to like use font without installing them. So first thing first, open your, uh, open your uh, google chrome. And in here, so go to the google.com, a uh, bing.com actually, doesn't matter, just go to the google.com. Obviously, obviously, most of people are using google.com and bing.com. Uh, anyways, guys, so in here, type the AMP font view. As you can see, it's already I already saw this one AMP font view. Once you are in here, so you Go f go to the first one. I'll put this in the link. I'll put this link in the description. You don't need to go to the Google and type it. If you want to, you can type that one. So it, this is the website that we are looking for. If if you use if if you type the AMP from viewers in your uh, Google and if you go with some or uh, some link, if the interface of your website doesn't look like that, then you are in the right. Might you have the scam or the virus? Try to go in this website. I'll put the link in description, guys. Once you are in here, <coughs> there are other type of software of the type of site you can like server or mirror. I'm just gonna use the zip file, guys. If you can also install, but I'm gonna use zip file. But why? I, because I can't install them. I can't install them. So okay, so it's now downloaded. I'm just gonna open this one, and and next up, I'm gonna create a new folder I'm gonna call the font font viewer for viewer I think that's for. okay so once I got I got this one I'm gonna open this one actually I'm not gonna open I'm just gonna drag this one to the here copy to the font viewer now once it's finished so as you can see these are the files do not delete any of them now go to the Google or uh, any Google and go to the dfont.com or you can use the other type of website you can just go ahead and search for the df uh, like fonts for windows uh, okay so i'm just i'm just gonna use the war it's over because it's like i don't know i just use that one it's not nice it's not but like the take the the only first one takes swap and the other one i don't know what's wrong with this one okay i'm just gonna use something Let's go with the cartoon sketch, melon, graphic, cherry, mm -hmm. angry bot. Yeah, you know, angry bot. Now I'm gonna click on the download here. Now it's against it's now download. So, first thing I'm gonna go to my file manager or sorry, for like uh, explorer. For explorer. I'm just gonna go to the document. I'm gonna create a new folder. I'm gonna give uh, like name fonts. So guys, if you want to use the fonts uh, in the like letter, please do not delete them. Just create a folder anywhere in your computer and save them in there. So as you can see, it's now it's finished. Now go to the font viewer and open the font viewer application, exe application. So as you can see, now install it. There you go. That is the interface of your um, uh, MP font viewer. Now go to the not install it fonts. In here you can choose the directory to find that one. I'm gonna go use the font. Okay, there you go. Now in go to, I'm gonna go to the document and in the fonts where uh, what's that one? There you go font. Now there you go angry bot regular.ttf. If you click on the install selected font, it will not gonna because you can't install them. If you click on the his SSD night guys now click on the install font temporary and yes. there you go now install it it's not install it but like you can use for example for example i'm gonna go to the word 23rd 
for document I'm going to go to blank one I'm going to type my name and pick size now I'm going to sort the font A and G angry one there you go guys angry one that's how we can use that you don't need to install anything there's some important thing guys if you are using like Microsoft or Photoshop do not close this application also if you close what will happen if I just close one it will change to the default the default font. if you try to find the angry but you can't you can't because the application the MP firmware does need to running wherever you are using the font in any kind of software yep guys thanks for watching uh, like thumbs off subscribe to my channel it will only take this two seconds to subscribe guys like share if this does like help you and if you want to help other friends do subscribe or do share do comment if you wanna what you want to see in the next video so I'll get that one do comment guys and visit my blog which is the www.abhishekshama.com Go to view the link will be in annotation in my screen just go ahead and click that one do ahead and subscribe guys it will only take two seconds click that subscribe button guys thanks for guys peace out enjoy your day